Hey, what's up? John Shred here. And when I was at CES this year, I interviewed the CEO and founder of Unistellar, a smart telescope that I, I had no idea existed. It was one of the last interviews I did, and I was, I was blown away by it. It was something that I thought it was really cool. So here, please check out the interview. Hey, John Shred here, and we are at Unistellar here. We're looking at a smart telescope. This is Laurent, and he's going to tell us about it. Yeah, sure. So what we do at Unistellar is that we reinvent the telescope. Okay. to make astronomy that marvelous, wonderful journey we all dream of when we think about a telescope. A journey through space with okay. marvels, with colors, with stars, That's what with we mysteries. Want. Yes. That's what we want. We tend to be disappointed with normal telescopes because first we don't see much. And they're quite hard to use. You have to know. I've, I've tried to use yeah. them. I mean, they can't get it. It's, it's blurry. And then you see it for a second and, and then it's gone. OK, so that's why we sold with these telescopes. Yep. We first made them super powerful thanks to digital technologies. Okay. You will be able to see galaxies, nebulae, comets, many beautiful objects. Better than a normal one? Yeah, a lot oh, better. OK. And um, so that's the first thing. Very powerful instrument. You okay. see a lot more. Great. Second thing, we made them super smart, super pleasant to use. Okay. So that journey is really pleasant. Okay, how is it pleasant? You use the app and yeah, you kind of... Exactly. You use a companion app okay. that you connect to the telescope. Uh, the telescope will get your GPS position from your phone. Okay. It will Easy. take a picture from the sky. Yeah. Boom, from there it knows where it is. Okay. So it can orient itself. It will tell you what's interesting to see tonight. Select any of those objects, it will point automatically and track the object. Wow. So you punch in there and say, I, I want to look at the moon, you click boom. on it, it just it just turns automatically and you got a shot. Exactly. And can you zoom in, zoom out? How does that all work? How does, yeah. it, how does it know the depth of the shot? Uh, so it's infinity focus. Oh. I mean, uh, all the objects of space are so far yeah. that it's on infinity focus okay. uh, for, the, for the telescope. Wow. OK, so you have this. It looks like it's battery operated. Exactly. Okay, cool. So you bring this thing outside, you set it up, I mean, and then you download the photos to the companion app and then you share it with your friends. Exactly. Yeah. That seems pretty cool. And, and it sounds like, I mean, like how many people do you have using this around uh, the world right now? So we have, we have passed the 10,000 user wow. mark like one year ago. Okay. And so now we have a huge community of users all around Earth, okay. which allows us to do actually uh, astronomical science in partnership with NASA and SETI Institute. We even have users okay. who have been published at, as co-authors of discoveries in nature, what? nature publications, yes. Ah, uh, <laughs> you're, you're crowdsourcing exactly. content for, wow, exactly. using these. Okay, I mean, okay, I want to get one of these. How do I get one? Can, can I buy one right now? Yeah, so they're live uh, on our website, okay. Amazon, Best Buy. Okay. Some other resellers. Put some links down below. You guys can check it yeah. out. Yeah. Okay. So since a few hours, you can order them. Yeah. Deliver in uh, two or three days. Easy. And um, so we have two models. Okay. One of 20, 2500 Yeah. And one at four four thousand dollars. Okay. And uh, that's it. One has a digital eyepiece. Okay. High quality eyepiece Better for eyepiece for the for the immersion, etc. Okay. okay. And one without eyepiece entry level. Okay, cool. And uh, and either way, though, you still get the same beautiful photos in either model. The, the capability, the imaging capability is, uh, is similar between the two models. Perfect. But one has this uh, immersive eyepiece immersive. Cool. that the other doesn't have. Well, Laurent, thank you very much. This is so cool that I learned about it. <laughs> Because I didn't know anything about them today, so thank you very much. Great pleasure. Thank like I say, I, I was really interested to hear about telescope. I know nothing about telescope, but but it really fits into the technology niche that I'm working in. And so, I mean, if you've used one of these telescopes or you're interested, please leave a comment down below. Let me know kind of more about it. Uh, I, I would love to use one myself and really see what they're about. But please tell me and give me some feedback. Thank you so much for watching and see you on the next one.